This video presents the result of an underwater robot performing autonomous exploration of an unknown visually degraded environment using vision as the sole means for perception. We demonstrate the experiment in the dry dock of an old submarine bunker, Dura 2, in Trondheim, Norway, submerged in about 5 meters of unfiltered water from the Trondheim fjord. In this experiment, we use Ariel, an underwater robot based on Blue ROV with a custom casing for AlphaSense development kit with multi-camera and IMU setup. And it also houses NVIDIA Orin AGX as an onboard computer. The robot also contains a black flag color camera and the low-level controller is based on Pixox 6X. The robot's state estimation is based on combination of two methods, React ROVIO and Deep VL. React ROVIO or Refractive Aquatic ROVIO is a refraction-aware multi-camera visual inertial state estimation method that estimates both the robot state and the refractive index of the water, which in turn enables deployment without any prior medium-specific camera calibration. Deep VL or Deep Velocity Learning is a learning-based proprioceptive robot velocity prediction method that enhances the robustness against visual degradation by velocity aiding to react ROVIO and enables state estimation with as few as four visual features. The robot depth mapping capabilities are based on stereo matching, while VoxPlox is used for volumetric mapping. The environment is illuminated using the four LEDs on the robot with negligible external illumination due to the dark Nordic winter conditions during the experiment. For exploration, the robot uses a graph-based exploration path planner or GV planner to autonomously explore the region in the unknown environment with bounds of 20 by 20 meters. The exploration is then followed by autonomous general visual inspection. This experiment highlights the interoperability of the path planner which has been rigorously deployed on aerial and ground robots and holds an identical formulation for the underwater robot. It represents a step towards form of unified autonomy across robot configurations. Lastly, we show the final map and the filtered point cloud from the autonomous exploration and inspection alongside the camera view at the start and the end of the mission after homing, highlighting the resilience of the visual inertial state estimation and exploration path planning in visually degraded underwater environments.